What's going on ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. Today we'll be talking about the Evolve Paladin class, or should I be calling it the Arch Paladin class? I will figure out that later, but uh, we have a bunch of news concerning the class uh, from the past few days that I want to go over. This isn't a typical news video. I'm not going to be covering all the different types of news, just news uh, specifically towards the new class that will be coming out this Friday. So let's get into the video. All right, so I have both a tweet and a design notes post to go over in this video. Uh, but first, if you don't know what birthday classes are, basically AQW has their birthday every year, the day that the game went out of beta into open, uh, into the open release, it was released. I guess that's what they call it, released. Uh, so it went out of beta. Uh, that's the day that their birthday is, and it's on the 16th of October, which lands on this Friday. <clears throat> that's the Friday closest to it, of course. So every birthday, they do a class. They put out a new class. And I think last year's was uh, Omni Knight, Ultra Omni Knight. The year before that was Artifact Hunter. This year, we will be getting a Paladin class. I'm just going to call it a Paladin class because... Uh, they were referring to it as the Evolve Paladin, but they changed the name, at least, um, uh, okay, so if you look at this post, as of the October 9th, which was two days ago from when I'm recording this video, it was the Evolve Paladin class. If you read the Zine Notes post here, it's called the Arch Paladin class. So... I do. I this is the most recent post was the Arch Paladin, so I guess the name would be Arch Paladin. I kind of like Evolve Paladin better as a name for the class, and like this looks like an in-game thing. So we're gonna be talking about this first. So there's a lot of things you can infer from this image that maybe new players would not uh, notice right away. So we have the eighth birthday, the eighth birthday uh, rares. So that's the rares that we come out on the eighth birthday. We already got. Uh, some screenshots of like the helmet with a bunch of ice cream scoops on top of it that'll be in that shop and uh, probably a few other really cool items in there and the underground lab which uh, there'll be new stuff at the underground lab for their birthday and it goes through the throne of darkness right here so the throne of darkness the quest line that we're doing I would highly highly recommend that you play through the throne of darkness because it may be required uh, to unlock the class so as you can see, the, so this is the, pay, this is the uh, thing that will pop up when you want to unlock the class, right? And you can see it's all grayed out right now, which probably means they haven't implemented, uh, or they're on a test account where none of the uh, events are done. Uh, so it could be where they, they're not going to lock the rare shop, and they're not going to lock the underground lab, but they could lock the quest, the all-player quest, or the member quest, or both. Uh, until you finish the quest line, uh, they could do that. That's they've done things like that before, and they could do it now. So if you want to get the class as soon as it comes out, you want to start farming for it, I would highly recommend you go through and you finish the full Throne of Darkness saga up to the part one of the finale, which was the last one that came out last Friday, uh, because they are grayed out right now. These all these buttons would normally be red. Uh, but they're all gray, which means they're locked uh, when they're gray. So they could all be locked if uh, if they so chose to make them lock. So that's basically what I want to go through here. And the, we can also see if the members get the class faster. That's how it's been every other year too. Every birthday you can get the class faster for your member. So if you want to buy a member to get the class faster, you can do that this Friday. Um, Alright, so I thought we were over this. I thought... I'm inferring right here. Uh, this is an uh, educated guess based on past uh, birthday classes and uh, the future. But I thought I thought we passed this. Um, begin the quest. All right, so I'll highlight it in blue here for the reading pleasure of the people watching. And actually, let's zoom in a little bit. Enhance. I can't. Can I enhance more? Enhance. Enhance. All right, there we go. <laughs> All right, so begin the quest to unlock. Artix, Arch Paladin class, or buy it for 2,000 rich coins. So it does not say, all right, so begin the quest. So multiple quests, 
uh, which makes me think that you, that makes me continue to think that you need to do the storyline, uh, all these uh, quests, all those quest lines to unlock Arch, Arch Paladin class. Um, so it could be dailies. The way they word it, it's not not confirmed that it's not a daily quest. Uh, does that make? It's like grammar proper? No, it's not. But um, <laughs> it could be a daily quest, which I would be very upset about. I would probably buy phrase season and then farm the dailies and then sell it phrase season once I'm done with the dailies. But I don't. I don't like this. I don't like the dailies. They. I know they make more money uh, off making the class a daily um, because it just makes people buy it because dailies are such BS. But eh, it could happen. Hopefully, it does not. Um, just a heads up for anyone. Uh, if you want to read this post, there's a bunch of information about this Friday's update, uh, including like, yeah, it's a new AC pet. I'll be covering all this in the news video. Of course, this video is about the class. So, uh, also, 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 this video is very, very not, uh, let me, let me fix that. All right. All right. So I'll be right back. All right, here we are at the antique shop, the most recent update. So if you're wondering why this video seems a little off, like I seem a little off, I had literally, literally three and a half hours of sleep last night. Thanks, dentists. I love eight o'clock appointments in the morning. That's when I love to wake up at uh, six o'clock so I can get to the office at eight. So I got up at six, so I went to sleep at like three. All right, um, <laughs> so no sleep today, but videos. I wanted to make this video just to make let everyone be informed and make sure that people are done these quests because if you have to, if you had to do the whole thing on Friday that would really suck if you're looking forward to getting the class and you were unaware that you probably needed to do the quest although I am just guessing that you need to do all the quests it's not being confirmed but that's just a very good guess so if we come here uh, the quests here if we look at the quests they give you reputation so you get a hundred rep per turn in on this farming quest along with all these other items. The class could also require reputation. It's a possibility. Uh, has it happened before in other birthday classes? Not to my knowledge. If, uh, if it has, please leave a comment correcting that, but not to my knowledge a, a rep has ever been involved in another birthday class. It's a possibility though. What if, <laughs> what if they scumbagged it? They made it so you had to finish the quest lines, you had to do daily quests, and you had to have rank 10 rep. Oh my god. <laughs> and, and you had to like farm a boss with a million health for like 100 kills or something like that, like uh, other classes. Like, what if they did all that for one class? Oh my god. So, I will be buying the class races uh, when it comes out. I'll be doing a class guide. I'm not sure if Red Zone or Alex or any of those other guys uh, that also do the AQW content on YouTube are going to be doing a class guide on it. So, I'm actually going to work pretty hard on doing a class guide. I'm going to use the class. I'm going to buy the class races, rank it up on the stream, play with it the whole stream. Do the I'm not going to do the quest line until I get the class to rank 10. Then we'll play through quest line with the class. We'll use the class in PvP. We'll do all that stuff on the stream. And then... Uh, on Saturday the day after or actually maybe Friday night I'll do a class guide on the class and I'll actually put a lot more effort than normal into the class guys because I don't know if anyone else is gonna do a class guide someone has to do a class guide and if that someone is me I will try my best to do it so all right so a recap of this video basically if you're uh, if you tuned out at any point which maybe a pretty boring video but it's just there could be rep involved there you most likely have to finish all the quests in the quest line. Uh, I think that was confirmed somewhere by Elena. Um, maybe not. Uh, but uh, there was some. I don't know. It wasn't confirmed. Not to my knowledge. But there was uh, a set of armor that was confirmed. So it wouldn't be out of the uh, realm of possibility that the class requires you to finish all the quests. Uh, so if I wasted your time by you doing the quest and it comes to Friday and. Uh, and you didn't need to do the quest, I apologize. I mean, the quests are okay. The quest line is good, and there's good, like, there's a class in one of the quest lines that you can get from a boss. And there's a bunch of cool stuff in the quest lines. I'd highly recommend you play through them, even if it wasn't to get the class, even if that class didn't exist. But, uh, yeah, thanks for watching the video, guys. If you enjoyed it, leave a like. Uh, if I helped you out, leave a like. I don't know. 
Uh, hopefully, it's not a daily quest. If someone from Argus Entertainment's watching, my opinion would be uh, make it a uh, farming quest. Like, uh, go farm this uh, boss over here, get get his drops, maybe go farm uh, these monsters over there, get a few of their drops, and then uh, put them all in a pot, mix it up, and boom, you got a class. I, I don't know. But hopefully, it's not a daily quest. It could be because most of the other ones were. Except Artifact Hunter, you could get the tokens from the boss so or hopefully it's a lot like artifact hunter where if you want to just do dailies you can but if you want to farm it hard then you can go and farm it hard for eight hours straight like i've done before for almost every class that comes out so again thanks for watching and i'll see you guys all in the next one peace click the video in the top right corner if you haven't seen it yet and i'll see you all in the next one